Hi. Um, I thought I would do a little haul with you. I have just been out on my lunch break and I had to pop and get some shops. And as is always the way, I stopped at shops that I didn't need to stop into. Stop into? Head into. Um, and I bought things that I didn't need. But I thought I would show you what I got because why not? I haven't done a haul in a long time. Welcome back to my channel. Um, for those of you who are new, who might be a lot of you, um, my name is Teresa and I have just restarted vlogging again recently after a little bit of a two year break. Um, I've had babies, etc. And it's just all a bit crazy. I hope you can see me okay and I hope the light isn't reflecting too bad off my glasses. I will try to keep my head down a bit so that it's not. Um, so yeah, welcome, welcome and let's dive in. Okay, so this is a really random haul because I went to uh, a few different places really. The first one I popped to was Pound Stretcher. So I'll show you what I got from Pound Stretcher. Ha ha, so these snack cakes, the girls absolutely love these. I think they might be individually wrapped, which is probably not good with regards to plastic, etc., and wastage and wastage, but do you know what I mean? What's the word I'm trying to think of? Packaging, excess packaging. That's what I'm trying to think of. Um, but these are really good. They're like little milky cakes and the girls really like them for snacks. They're really good if you go on picnics, you shove them in the bag. Um, snack latte, they're called, with milk cream filling. Now these were £1.25 for 10, which is a bargain. Um, and they were reduced, I think, because it's, they're near the sell-by date, but that's the 28th of May. My girls will have eaten them by then. So I got two. I got the normal latte ones and I got the cocoa ones, which are like the chocolate ones. They look like this. Can you see those there? And the chocolate ones. Um, they've got a different name actually, and then these are the latte ones. So we got that. Um, I got some flat white Dolce Gusto coffee pods um, because we haven't used our coffee machine in a while because we've run out of stuff. I love the cappuccino ones. Um, and I saw the flat white and I was like, I've never tried a flat white, so we're gonna try the flat white ones and I got the cappuccino. Oh. Oh, the cappuccino ones as well. Um, they were 3 99 and I think there's eight, yeah, there's eight like drinks in each. They're 3 99 each. Now I don't know whether that's good or bad. So I'm gonna, cause it's been such a long time since I bought them. I'm gonna do a bit of a recce and see how much they usually are. But you know, I didn't actually think pound stretcher was that cheap. I thought, yeah, you are stretching the pound quite a bit to be honest. Um, Dust pan and brush because the amount of times that I've gone to get ours, I can't find it. I don't know where it's gone. I think Chris has used part of it outside and hasn't put it back. So we've got a brush, but it's manky, but we don't have a dust pan bit. So um, yeah, got a dust pan and brush. I don't remember how much this was. I just grabbed it because I thought we needed it. Although it doesn't actually look very secure. God, that's what happens when you buy something from Power Stretcher, isn't it? Um, but yeah, dust pan and brush does what it says in the tin. Uh, what else do we get? Uh, some nappy bags because we always need nappy bags. I just not, I cannot wait for her to be potty trained. And I was thinking about this earlier. I was like, when she's potty trained, we're gonna come out of out of things. Like, oh my god, we are near the time where we probably aren't gonna want to buy nappies anymore. Like we've been doing that for five years. It's crazy. It's crazy, crazy, crazy. Um, I bought this little, this was reduced, I think it was like 75p, and it is a, I don't know if you can see that, I'm hoping you can. It's a Christmas one, that's why it was reduced. Um, it's just a peppermint hand sanitizer, but I bought it because it's got a hook on it. Um, and I've lost the one that is on the nappy bag. So when we go out anywhere, we don't really have a hand sanitizer that we can just really quickly use. So I'm gonna hook that on the nappy bag and it's still on the nappy bag. I'm hoping that, it, because the nappy bag gets thrown about, I'm hoping it's not gonna leak or, or what have you, but it smells all right. I don't think it smells of peppermint. A tiny bit maybe, peppermint crush. It's, you know, it's hand sanitizer, so. And then the last thing I got was for the girlies and it was for fruit shoots. Um, they were a pound. Not much you can say about fruit shoots. They're always handy to have in. Um, so if we're going out anyway, just grab them, put them in the bag. Okay, right. So that was pound stretcher. Now we go into my pound land bag, but there are other bits in here that I've thrown in here um, because, you know, you can't always, get a bag in every shop. 
I don't know what I'm talking about. Um, I popped into uh, Body Shop because this is the makeup remover that I use. It's the Chamomile um, Makeup Cleansing Butter. Caroline Hirons recommended it. I watched her on something and she recommended this. And I was like, yes, I need that. I have really dry skin. Um, and this literally has hardly anything in it. Sens it's suitable for sensitive skin and my skin is so sensitive. I have gone through so many makeup removers, so many foundations, so many bits of makeup. And once you've got your staple one that works, I just think just stick with it. Um, they've changed the branding on this. This used to look a little bit different than it does, but it's £12 for the whole tin. It lasts for quite a while. If I show you what it looks like, it just looks like this. I don't know if you can see that. Um, but it melts. There you go. If I rub that, you'll see. Can you see how? Can you see where I've rubbed? Maybe you can't. Maybe you can. Maybe you can't. Um, and it just melts. And you literally put it on your little bit on your eyes, and it melts all your makeup away. It is fantastic. So that's really good. And when I was in there, I needed a new one. When I was in there. I spotted that they had these little tiny ones. I don't know if you can see that at all. There you go. On the um, on the till, and I was like, amazing, because I don't really want to take a massive one when I go away, um, because that's quite big to take away. Now this was six pound, so half the price, and it's probably a quarter of the size. But I'm gonna pop it in my wash bag, and it's gonna stay in my wash bag. So if we go away for a couple of nights anywhere or anything like that, then we have a little one. So that's gonna go straight in my wash bag. Um, I got a, I went popped into the works and I got, I'm going to take the price of this off because I don't want the person who I've bought this for, well, the person I bought this for is not going to see this because, you know, he's two, um, but I don't want the mum of the person who I bought this for to see how much I spent on it. <laughs> um, I popped into the works, I've got, my, one of my friends has got, um, her little boy is two, and so I bought him some number jigsaw puzzles which are very cute. I'm not going to tell you how much these were for obvious reasons because I don't want her knowing how much I spent. I'm not that, you know, I don't, I don't really know why. Um, but I love, I love the works. I love the works for little gifts, little books. If you, I've actually went in there to get him some nice little books and I found these and thought, well, actually these might be quite nice. Um, and then just a little puzzle. If it's anything like Lily, um, Lily loves puzzles, adores puzzles. I hope you can see that okay. And it's the Dex the Dino um, wooden puzzle that I thought might be quite nice as well. So that's from the works. Then from the works, I also got this book. I have been, um, I love, I follow and subscribe to Brogan Tate's channel if you don't follow her she's amazing she's a fantastic vlogger I love her she reads tons of books now I am not a very very good book reader it would take me ages to read a book literally ages um but all the books I've got are like by autobiographies and I wanted like a storybook and I want to try and read before I go to bed every night just to put my phone down for a bit and just to reset my mind um, and it also makes me sleep a little bit better and she has just been recently recommended this book here which is um lauren asher international best-selling author 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 um it's the dreamland billionaires collection there are three in this range um and this one is called the fine print and she was recommended it because she is a also a disney vlogger um so she'll vlog she goes to disney quite a lot disney in paris disney world i have an obsession with watching vloggers who go to disney yes i do um and everybody recommended that she read this because it is all about theme parks dreamland that type of thing and she loved it so I was like do you know what for six pound in the works they had them all they were six pound each I thought I'm gonna give it a go I think I need a nice little easy read and I think this might be the one for it so I'll let you know how that goes might give a little bit of a review probably in a year's time because it might take that long for me to read it um I got a little two birthday card to go with the present um right now we're into poundland yes because that was from poundland so I popped into poundland i've got some bits from poundland I've got some of the orange mini eggs from poundland um i got ah i got a foot mask so i have the world's most disgusting feet 
they're really dry i get really bad eczema on them they crack they're really sore and now that it's kind of coming into warmer times i'm gonna have to be a bit savvy with the old foot masks just because i think my feet need so much moisture um and yeah when they're in open toe shoes etc etc so i thought i'd try this one it's a fern mccann one um with her range in poundland it was two pound and uh recreate the luxury spa experience at home with my new foot mask for the ultimate pamper the fragrance is lavender and rosemary and it's got vitamin e lavender lemon coriander rosemary geranium and it's one pair of boots you leave them on for 20 minutes to calm and soothe the stresses of your day leave it on for 20 minutes and then you just rub all the moisturizer in and yeah so i'll probably do that one night before bed that's what it looks like there hope you can see it that light the light's not very good is it sorry um so i got that for two pounds i got some cookie cut um i got some cookie cutters for the girls because i chris's mum got them some cookie cutters or, or gave them some cookie cutters and i stupidly had them in the air fryer and i put the air fryer on and they melted so i had to get the girls some new cookie cutters there we go i want to say they were a pound they probably were a pound let's have a look i think there was more stuff that was a pound in poundland than in pound stretcher I don't know where my receipt is here we go i know i've kept my receipt because i have to um and the reason i have to is i'll show you in a sec these cookie cutters were a pound there we go oh and actually the foot mask was a pound i thought that was two pounds so foot mask was a pound so if that's any good then that's i'll let you know how that goes i got some of the refresher squeezies i am trying to be on the ball ready for um summer shove these in the girls absolutely love them and yeah they were i think they were a quid as well or 125 125 they were um what else did i get oh pretty much it right i bought some sliders for holly i'm hoping they're the right size i'm ashamed to say i don't actually know what size she is now um she her feet don't seem to grow very quickly so i'm thinking these are a 10 i'm thinking that it might be okay but if not we'll we'll send them back they were three pound fifty and I thought she might like them. And the only reason I got them for her is because I know she'd have absolute kittens being left out because I got these for Lily and they are so cute. Oh, hang on, they've come off the hanger. I mean, how cute are these? How cute! I love the fact that they have, let's take them off, they have the Velcro on the top bit because um, both my girls have quite quite high um the tops of their feet are quite high and so they don't get into shoes easily so with this you can just kind of if it needs to be a bit wider it can be a bit wider i don't know we'll see how we go with them should try them on later but i knew if i got her those and i didn't get holly something she would freak and these are the reason i need to get the receipt okay um these were six pound and i just thought they were really really cute so that's it that's my little um haul Thank you for joining me if you like this video please click the like button down below please consider subscribing that would be absolutely lush i would love to have you and uh, don't forget to hit the bell button to make sure that you get notified when i upload a new video but yeah um i hope you enjoyed the vlog and i shall see you soon bye bye